Well, a good Tuesday afternoon to ya. It's Dan. I want to welcome everyone to my home in the sticks. I hope everybody's having a good Tuesday and a good start to a new week. But over here in East Central Mississippi, we in the lowest 60s right now. We just got rid of some rain, so it's nice to be outside now. Before we get started on today's video, I always like to mention that if you are new to the channel, I want to welcome you. And if you returning just to see what old Dan's got going on over her, I show sure enough thank you for coming back. But what I want to share with you and y'all today is we got to play catch up. I'm going to show you what I've been doing the last couple of days. Give me a second. That's what we finna do. <laughs> Dan, where you been the last couple of four days? Lord of mercy, I'm here to tell you. Over the weekend, my main plan was to do a whole bunch of bush hogging, especially out in this pasture behind me. But we had a bunch of rain move in on Saturday. I'm here to tell you. I'm gonna walk over here and I show you, I'm gonna show you what I started doing. All right, there's my pasture. This is probably about a two acre pasture that I have fenced off four horses oh there's hank out there you see all that brown stuff sticking up we call that milkweed over here and it doesn't really look tall uh, in the video but that milkweed is probably six to seven feet tall it's actually this stuff right here we call it milkweed i don't know exactly what the name of this stuff is but it just grows all over the place this stuff was all in that passion. I, I had to get it cut down. And I started working on it Saturday into Sunday. And what I'm gonna do is, um, started on it Saturday, was planning on doing some videoing on Sunday and it really looked like it was gonna come a flood over here. So I, I took some, some still pictures and put them up now. The bad part about this is down there in those lower pastures, it gets real soft and muddy. So you get a tractor stuck down there, guess what? You're gonna have to leave the tractor there until it drives up and pull it out. And then Monday evening was uh, Philadelphia's annual Christmas parade. So I actually, I had to work that too. And Lord have mercy, it was cold. The wind was blowing, it was probably in the teens. It was just extremely, extremely cold. What are you doing, Hank? So I just didn't, this weekend and going into the week, I just, oh gracious, I just been busy as I'll get out over here. But I wanted to show uh, you and y'all what, what I've been up to over here at the homestead you know i like to share and it's it's just been normal homestead work that i had i had to really had to catch up on especially with the bush hogging it was just getting so tall you couldn't even see the horse out there and that's my fault because i should have done i should have done bush hog that pasture a long time ago finally caught up with me what i also wanted to bring up is for some strange reason 
I get a lot of comments that folks leave me on certain videos. I get them late. I've answered some comments here lately that have been almost, almost a year old, two years old, eight months old. So I apologize for that. And when you see the comment just pop up, hey, I just got it. And I like to reply to all the comments that people leave to me. I don't know if that's a glitch with YouTube, but I answered the comments. So y'all, that's what I wanted to share with you and y'all today. I wanted to bring y'all up to speed as to what's going on over here in East Central Mississippi. And here lately, it's been rain and trying to catch up on a bunch of bush hogging that needs to be done. I finally uh, caught up now, so maybe I will get on track, but it, it is what it is. I'm army of one over here and things sometimes pile up on you sometimes and it takes a few days to get them unpiled. So again, I hope everybody is having a show enough good Tuesday, and I hope everybody's being safe amid this crisis that we still have going on. If you like this video, go and give it a thumbs up, they help. If you haven't subscribed to the Home Mistakes channel, law of mercy. Y'all need to come on over here, give old Dan a look, because I'm always doing stuff, trying to catch up on stuff. With that being said, you know it's coming down right for show enough, always gonna say it. Don't let nobody do your shine. And I mean nobody. You showing sure up, get your shine on. It's important. And Dan will see you and y'all in the next video.